Hold on to your seats, brace yourself for breaking news. Jupiter, the colossal hydrogen-rich giant in our cosmic backyard, is on the brink of a spectacular explosion set to reshape our entire solar system. But fear not, let's dive into the cosmic wonders and unravel the mysteries. Ever heard of the uniplanetary evolution theory? It's a captivating concept that suggests each planet in our solar system represents a different stage of Earth's evolution. Imagine looking at a cosmic gallery of Earth's past, present and future, all at once. So let's embark on a journey through time and space, exploring the epochs of our home planet from its fiery past to its icy future. We'll witness the birth of life, the rise of civilizations and the eventual end of everything we hold dear. And yet it's not all doom and gloom. This seemingly bleak phenomenon ignited life on our planet in the first place, a cosmic version of the chicken and the egg. Stay tuned as we delve into the cosmic secret of our existence. Mars, the red planet, is Earth, one billion years in the future after an extinction level impact. Witnessing our celestial neighbor, Mars, is like peering through a cosmic time machine. It's a world that boasts valleys, mountains, weather, seasons, volcanoes, and ice caps. In fact, its day is only slightly longer than ours, and it once held enough liquid water to support life, revealing an uncanny resemblance to our own planet. Mars even had an electromagnetic field and tectonic plates just like Earth's. And the icing on the cake? It has two moons that appear to be fragments of something much larger akin to our own moon. Now let's journey into Earth's past and meet Venus, our planetary twin. Sharing a similar size, mass and composition with Earth, Venus is a turbulent world, shrouded in thick clouds of sulfuric acid and an atmosphere dominated by carbon. This is a glimpse of Earth before it was graced with a moon and the presence of liquid water. But how did Earth transition from a Venus-like state to the life-sustaining planet we know and love? The answer may lie in a catastrophic cosmic event. Scientists propose that a massive impact with a theorized planet, Theia, gave birth to our moon. Think of it as a grand celestial game of billiards with planets as the balls on the table. But what triggered this cosmic collision? The uniplanetary evolution theory could hold the answer, suggesting a cosmic cycle of destruction and rebirth that's been playing out over billions of years. The ignition of Jupiter's hydrogen could result in an immense explosion, transforming Jupiter into Saturn, complete with its magnificent rings of debris. This cataclysmic event could trigger a chain reaction of collisions and transformations throughout our solar system. Scientists believe that a massive impact from a theorized planet named Theia created our moon, like a cosmic game of billiards. What caused these planets to collide? The answer to this question may unlock the secrets of our past, our future, and our place within the cosmos. According to the uniplanetary evolution theory, it proposes that in the future, Earth will become Mars, and similarly, Jupiter will transform into Saturn. This theory may sound like a grand leap of imagination, but it's grounded in a profound understanding of our universe and its cyclical nature. Imagine for a moment Jupiter, the celestial giant, igniting into a spectacular explosion. This event is not merely a spectacle of cosmic fireworks, but a transformational moment reshaping Jupiter into Saturn with its glorious rings of debris. This theory suggests that such cataclysmic events are not just destructive, they're also creative forces. Now let's consider Mars. As per the theory, Mars is a future representation of Earth after a catastrophic impact. The debris from this collision scatters to form the inner asteroid belt, while Earth's moon shatters, leaving behind two of its largest fragments, Deimos and Phobos, as Mars's moons. This cataclysmic event then disrupts Earth, causing it to lose a significant amount of mass and material, reshaping it into Mars. And what about Venus, often referred to as Earth's past twin? The debris from the Earth-Mars collision clusters together to form a moon for Venus, while Venus itself over time evolves into Earth. This theory thus suggests a cyclical process where Earth's material still forms our moon, but it's a future Earth. This brings us to an intriguing question, why is Mars so much smaller than Earth? The answer, according to the uniplanetary evolution theory, is that Earth broke off a piece of itself to form our life-giving moon. It's almost as if Earth gifted a piece of itself to its past incarnation, a testament to the eternal cycle of creation and destruction that shapes our universe. The explosion of Jupiter, 
A future Earth destroying current Earth but essentially creating our past Earth in the same events is mind-boggling. It's a cosmic Ouroboros, a snake swallowing its tail, a symbol seen in ancient cultures worldwide. This eternal cycle of destruction and rebirth is not just a philosophical concept but a fundamental principle of our universe. This is the secret that they've been trying to share with us. Thank you for joining us on this extraordinary journey. If you are a passionate explorer of the mysteries in our cosmos and eager to uncover new perspectives, you've come to the right place. We post thought-provoking videos every day, so don't miss out on any of our mind-blowing episodes. Hit that subscribe button now and embark on more awe-inspiring voyages of discovery.